The Iowa Great Lakes is a summer destination for a lot of Siouxlanders, but if you boat, the rules are changing, at least in the short term. While the geese are enjoying the extra water in the Iowa Great Lakes, that extra water is causing problems for the lake's shoreline and the personal property like docks, boats, and boat lifts. Because of the damage that the waves can cause to property, Dickinson County Emergency Management voted to implement a five mile per hour speed limit for boats on all lakes in the county. This hasn't happened since 2018. So when the water gets high enough, it can actually start to affect the, the shoreline. And, and we did have some banks that collapsed in 2018. Um, the ground was just so saturated and the constant waves beating up against the shore just caused some of those high banks to collapse. So we're trying to prevent that. Of course, we can't prevent the wind from blowing and the wind from creating waves, but we can try and prevent the boats from creating a wake and causing damage that way. So The rule went into effect this afternoon at 4. Any boat caught going over the 5 mile per hour limit will be issued a citation for $95. We will be out as, as much as we have personnel to do, we will be out here enforcing those rules. Boaters also need to be aware of debris in the water caused by this past week's storm. There's a lot of debris in the water right now, which is causing a, a public hazard. So that's the main reason for this right now is all the debris floating. There's dock planks that are 16 feet long and inch and a half thick that if you hit them with your boat, it's going to leave a mark. There is also the economic impact that this rule could affect. While some businesses may be affected negatively by the speed limit rule, others may actually prosper from it. We cater to mostly fishermen here at the store, so uh, the fishermen probably actually maybe like it a little bit because uh, they don't have the pleasure boaters, the jet skiers out there tearing the lake up. Uh, we like that as well. We know this is a spot that people like to come do that, but uh, for the fishermen, they would probably rather not have all the pleasure boaters and jet skis out there. Don't let the speed limit rule affect your plans if you're planning to come up to Okaboji. Come on up and see us. I mean, we're still the same lakes and everything. Just because you can't go 50 mile an hour on the lake doesn't mean you can't come up and have some fun. Dickinson County Emergency Management is going to meet again this Friday to see if they can lift that wake rule. In the Iowa Great Lakes, Travis Chen, KCU 9 News.